The Emergency Management Agency is now at a level four status. The agency is encouraging you to take steps to stay informed, make a plan, and secure your home. Our Tony Sloan live in Storm 5 Titan this morning with more on their message. And uh, Tony, tell us more about this notice that TEMA has issued. Yeah, Ben, so it's a level four elevated status, and it means that Tima is currently bringing in more enhanced personnel for their 24-hour watch staff in the State Emergency Operations Center to track all of the possible risks of Hurricane Helene. Now, we've seen a lot of heavy rains, strong winds, and a lot of that is causing some potential for some very dangerous and risky driving conditions. As the hurricane continues its track, Tima says there are steps that you can take to protect yourself, your family and your property using these steps here. Number one, make sure your weather notifications are turned on, especially on your mobile devices. Some counties may offer emergency alerts through the local emergency management agency, so make sure you're always updated there. And don't forget about your News Channel 5 Storm Shield app. We'll be sure to keep you updated on everything that we're tracking across the area as well. Two, you can secure your home by clearing loose items like outdoor furniture, trash bins, and other things that could be dangerous in strong winds. And lastly, do not try to attempt to cross flooded roads or walkways. You know, turn around if the waters are dangerous and contact your local emergency management agency if you need some immediate assistance. These are points that we'll continue to emphasize throughout the morning as we track possible reports of damage, flooding, or even risky road conditions throughout out this morning. Of course, we'll keep you updated on everything that we learn, and we'll let you know if we see any reports of damages as well. I'll send it back to you.